हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल हाउ आर यू गाइज होप यू आर गेटिंग एडवांटेजेस फ्राम माई प्रिंटर पेयरिंग वीडियोज यूज राइट नाउ इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू देर इज वन एपसन थ्री फाइव जीरो डॉट मैट्रिक्स प्रिंटर द मॉडल नंबर इज एल क्यू थ्री फाइव जीरो वट इज़ द इशू विद दिस प्रिंटर आई विल चेक नाउ एंड आई ऑलरेडी गॉट द प्रॉब्लम बट आई वॉन्ट टू शो यू वट इज़ द प्रॉब्लम एंड हाउ टू फिक्स दिस प्रॉब्लम ओके गाइज Uh, now i will give the test command print test command then you will see uh, the issue and the solution of the issue stay with me while we complete with you here we go test command i am going to give it and you will see the issue with this printer okay start the printer look it's getting stuck Head is getting stuck. Head is not moving fast. Okay, this is a print head. It's getting stuck. Okay, what is the issue? Uh, I will show you, uh, guys. This is there is a plastic gear that rotate the ribbon. Okay, this is not uh, rotating well. It's it is getting stuck. Okay, I cannot rotate it. It's 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 uh, like a you can say it's a jam. Okay, today we will fix this gear and. I will tell you how to get access to to this gear and what is the solution of it. Okay, guys. First of all, we will disassemble the printer completely. Uh, follow the same step if you have the same problem with this printer. Okay. First of all, turn off the power. Disconnect the USB data cable. Fine. Then remove the paper also from inside. There you go. Uh, remove this side. this is the roller you can say roller now there are four screws viewers uh, four screws before we will up and screw this we will remove this because we cannot remove the top cover until this should be out okay here i will tell you the way to remove this you can see uh, here is one place here and one place here both we will pull from both side we will pull it like this so we will you can do it easily pull this out and then lift it fine then from both sides it will come out smoothly okay be careful that the parts you are uh, removing you have to place it at, at the same this is don't uh, fix it up or uh, forget to fix back so not difficult okay open this screw there you go top cover is removed now don't uh, worry we will open this this gear we have to remove this gear because this gear is stuck completely stuck Okay, here we go, viewers. We have to remove uh, this screw over here. Okay, we will remove this screw over here, and then we will release this part. Fine. Step by step, follow the instructions. So you will be able to fix your printer without taking it to any shop or. If you are a technician, you can. do it easily if you are a home user or consumer then it can take time to fix it for you for the first time when when we open even after watch the video the take time okay guys uh, here is this part is brought here fine now there is a one tiny lock here if you can see this lock Should we remove? Then we will move further. Okay, viewers. Uh, for this purpose, I will require scissor because this we can use this because lock is very small. Okay, look. Lock. We remove lock. Be careful. Don't misplace it or keep it. Safe. Then we use 
remove this up the top cover because we have to remove the belt also keep it here to your place then okay, like this move the belt fine till here it's very easy now two screws over here one here and one screw is here okay these two screw one and one okay don't touch this screw only these two one here and one here open it this one okay here we go now I will tell how what to do okay we have to lift this up we have to lift this uh, up all uh, because I, I cannot remove it outside until this should lift up so we have to remove these two screws I forgot to mention it before two screws here and two screws here we have to unscrew because we, are, we will lift it up with a little okay we cannot uh, move out cannot bring this out until we will one screw is here also because the cable is connected for ground remove this cable okay same like here two screws over here one is this here and one is here okay and remove this cable also okay yes, here we go now as i mentioned earlier i want to lift it up a little so we will lift it we will forcefully lift it up and then from here also okay here we go oh we have to remove this cover also because we cannot lift it up until remove this top cover of this uh, main board four screws this is just uh, don't uh, don't worry from uh, the many screws uh, if you are opening it first time if you are disassembling it first time no need to worry about just follow uh, me and you will be you can fix it back also some guys uh, they are they are afraid to disassemble the printer and they don't know how to fix the back fix it fix the all parts back so no need to worry about it's very easy okay one screw have fallen inside. Oh, okay, here we go. The screw was went inside. That's why I lift it up. Okay, well, why I was lifting it because I want to remove this part, remove this sensor cable because it's irritating. Okay, here we go. Okay, yes, this gear I was telling before that it's not working fine. Okay. So why it's not working fine? We will open this and check. Okay, here is lock over here. Two locks actually. Fine. Okay, good. Look, there is many dust inside, and we will clean this all. Okay, be careful. There are set of gears. Okay. So each time you will remove this gear, you should know that how to fix it back. Okay, the big gear will come over here. Fine, keep it here. Keep it here. Don't don't worry. Okay, don't afraid of these gears. Okay, remove this. We will fix it back again. And remove this gear also. Fine. And here is one gear. We will clean this all gears with the help of uh, old toothbrush or anything you have uh, water or anything you can clean this we will clean this gears fine here also remove the dust from these gears okay
so there is dust very many dust inside or you can say garbage or paper dust we will clean uh, everything and then we will fix back and check i will tell you after fix the gears how to check this gear is all fine or not okay with the help of big brush also you can clean this dust from here okay i can throw a little liquid uh, oil oily liquid over here okay we can clean it with the help of tissue Okay, fine. <coughs> Place back the gears. This is just for checking. Okay, this gear, this gear, sometimes uh, rotate hard, so you have to make sure that. Okay, we just clean this also. I think. Put a little spray here. Okay, so now it's time to fix back the gears. Then we will check. It will come here. Okay, and this gear will be we will put over here. Fine. If you have any grease or anything else, you can also place here because this gear not, should not be dry. Okay. Look, before it's, it was not rotating, now it's rotating. Where it was getting stuck. Okay, fine. This was the part that we removed from here. Same like this, we will return back. Return back. There was one screw over here. Fix back this screw. Check again, it's rotating. Okay, good. I will tell you how easily. Okay, I have to lift my camera up to tell you how can you fix this easily. Okay, like this. You uh, have to fix like this. Okay because this is the main part to fix this back okay guys okay fix i fixed it i will show you from upside how do you know that it's fixed okay like this okay we can put the screw now one screw is here and one screw is here okay yes Second screw here. Here we, is. Here we go. I will show you one thing to make it easier for you that how you know that it fixed well or not. Uh, you can see uh, there is one part of this uh, iron its uh, body will fix inside this uh, lock okay you have to make sure that you fix it well okay this is the sign you fix it well because if you will not fix this gear well the head will not move again okay now the cable we removed from down it was here before and move this cable out. the cable was here And it was here. The entire machine will fix back like this. And in the holes, there are four holes around.
Okay. <coughs> we fix this back successfully. Now the time is to fix this belt of gear carefully. Okay, like this. Okay. Okay, you can see. You can easily rotate this. Second one was when you push uh, this from here also, you can push little and you can uh, fix the belt on this gear. Fine. Okay, now the things we removed from here, uh, from this top gear. Okay, this is not working fine before it was stuck. Okay, now okay. And also fix this back uh, top cover of this gear. Uh, there were there were locks before then we will check over here okay make sure that you fix it well because this is also take uh, some of your time to fix these parts back as i mentioned earlier if you are opening it first time it will take your time so you can you can edit it in the beginning but you will enjoy also this is not a rocket science actually so I believe that anyone if he is opening it first time he can fix it at home. Okay viewers, to put this lock we will be required the long nose, nose player. I have nose player with me. This is the lock is, you have to put back here lock. So you have to keep it in the lock. Okay, so with the help of this long nose player i will fix this lock like this look with the help of this long nose player we fixed it back now there was one thing more this one that we removed it will come here and there will be, there will be one screw from the left side we will fix it like this okay screw will come on the left side this is the total protection of this gear okay so no need to worry about you can do it easily that's it now it's time to check before we assemble everything before we connect these grounded cables and everything we will before the ground we will check the splinter is working or not i will move, move the camera up and just we will put this uh, button uh, button panel here then we will check that it is working fine or not i will fix this one screw here also here we go okay the rest of screw will come here one two here two is there these will be hundred cables so now we will check the rest of the things i will check it either it's jamming or fine stay with me then we will fix back first to check okay here we go printer is ready and we will give print command look like it's working fine before this was getting stuck you see this is rotating it's rotating fine now now it's one more jam here. There's no ribbon here, so that's why you can't see anything. Our main purpose was to fix this uh, head jamming. Okay, viewers, I will disconnect the power because we will put back rest of the things. We removed that one. We Moved at least from here, fixed back here like this. Okay, this is our button panel. Will come like this. Okay, yes, viewers, uh, I fixed back uh, uh, these two cables were here before. Uh, grounding cables, we placed back. I uh, show you from the top, and uh, there are four main screws over here to the body. One, two, here and. 3 and 4 okay it's fixed now now time to place back the top cover okay you'll we'll see we will place back the top cover ok 
Okay, now we will place back our top cover. Okay, it will come smoothly. Then there are four screws that we removed before. And you see like this, uh, four screws over here. One, two, three, and four. Two things left viewers. Uh, one, this is side roller. We come over here. Okay, fine. And the main thing is that uh, we removed the first. This one, the gear will come on that side to the gear side. How you fix it? Uh, like this. Okay, like this. Take it inside from here. It will come very slowly. It will not difficult. Okay, look, it went inside very smoothly. Then from here and from here. Fine. You can see it's, it's rotating also. It means it's fixed well. Okay, because now we will check again one time more. Either it's uh, hanging or working fine. Let me connect the power cable. And we will place the A4 paper. Okay. Buttons are working fine as well. One second. I will give the print command. Okay, gave it. Look, it's working fine. No more jam. Okay viewers, and this was the method to fix this uh, Epson LQ350 dot matrix printer. Hope you understand the method. If you have any question, you can ask me in the comments about this printer. Any kind of problem you are facing, you can ask me in the comments. I will reply your questions. Thank you for watching in the end and take care guys. Stay blessed. Bye.